in the tank, a Queensland innovator with a product that's as Aussie as the great outdoors. Hi Sharks, my name's Tracy Bykoff. I'm here representing Far North Queensland and my award-winning product, the Original Rescue Swag. Assisting me today is my mum, Karen, and my twin sister, Michelle. I'm seeking $220,000 for 20% equity in my company. Let me set the scene for you. Imagine you're out horse riding with friend, you're having a lovely time, when suddenly disaster strikes. Your friend is thrown to the ground, her horse galloping off into the distance. You can see she's got immense pain in her arm. What do you do? You're an energy company employee. You're out on your four-wheeler checking a remote station when suddenly a brown snake launches from the long grass and strikes at your leg. You know you need compression and you need it now, but the first aid kit's back in the car on the highway. What do you do? I have the perfect solution for both these situations, the award-winning Original Rescue Swag. It is a comprehensive first aid kit that also doubles as a sling, a splint, a compression device and a water carrier. This kit is the ultimate in portability. Using the fit and forget lockdown system, you can attach it to any mode of transport without it bouncing or bumping around. By proportion and design, this kit is perfect to stow in boats and vehicles. Need to call for help? Carry your mobile phone in the easy access external pocket, or we can also fit you out with a personal locating beacon, which is hooked up to rescue satellite networks. Sharks, I need $220,000 to boost this product to fly like a red balloon. We have a talented team, an entrepreneurial spirit, and the building blocks of success. Show you've got swag, Sharks. Take a bite of this. That deserved a clap. <laughs> that was very good. Well, well done. Great pitch. Great pitch, Tracy. <laughs> Thank you. Where, where are you guys from? From Ariba. Oh, up near Lake Tinaru. Yes, correct. Yeah, nice. All right. <laughs> Queenslanders, good to hear. Yeah. So um, talk about your sales and date. So um, we started this in 2012, won an innovation award. In 2013, I put six months of my full-time effort into this and we sold $12,000 worth in 2013. 2014, we've actually sold $30,000 worth. So what is the average price per swag? At the moment, we're selling these online for $220. And what is it costing you to put them together and make them? At the moment, they cost us $100 to produce and then I need to pack them as well. However, I do now have a manufacturing solution that will halve those costs. What's the stuff that goes inside? What does that cost? Um, the stuff inside is $47.30. How much do you think you can get the other stuff down by? Um, I think I could get it down to at least 30 and you could change what you put inside Correct. by That's country what I'm too. to, yeah. Because, for example, the United States market or a exactly. European market might want different things inside it. Exactly. Tracy, what did you do before you got into this business of rescuing us all? <laughs> um, well, I've worked in a few different jobs as a teacher and a prison officer. Um, this really came about because I'm a horse rider and I didn't have a first aid kit that I could carry. It actually sits behind the saddle. It doesn't bounce around or bump on the horse, which, you know, every other solution is something that flaps around. Yeah. And it's really annoying. So I know that there is a need for this. I'm assuming you have some sort of patent or trademark on that? Correct. It's, we have the trademark on the um, branding. Sorry. That's do right. you each want one? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. We, we can pass one along, it's fine. Oh, OK. So we do have the trademark already. We are working towards the patent that covers the international sector. Yeah. Once that's approved, we can then file for different uh, countries. And so what, what's the, what's the 220000 being used for, please? Half of that amount is for manufacturing. Obviously, we need to market this product, so there's allocation for that. Patent costs will be incorporated in that as well. Are you validated over a million? How did you arrive at the valuation? I understand its potential value. I anticipate 8,000 units sold within one calendar year of launch, resulting in $1.6 million in income. Do you know what 8,000 means? Absolutely. Do you know how many a day that is? Yep, I've how done many? the cash flow. How many? And how it's many 800 day? a month. <laughs> <laughs> so that's 30 a day. I, I fundamentally don't believe you're going to hit that next year.
Have you made any large corporate sales? Have you presented to a mining company or a corporation where they bought 20, 50, 100 at a time? I've done uh, probably about 20 at the maximum. 20 um, in one bite? Correct. To value a company at that, what that means is you have to sell so many before you can return uh, the investment. It just makes it that much riskier and that much harder. On this particular construct of the deal, I'm out. OK, thanks, Naomi. You have a vision for it, which is, is all the big ticks. The valuations I do have a problem with. Sure. It's, um, it's too early to ask for that much for okay. it. It's not, it's not worth that yet. Sure. That is the only reason I'm out, but um, I will definitely be a customer of yours. Awesome. I'll be happy with that. Thank you, Ginny. <laughs> I'd love to show you our new prototype too, if you'd like to have a look. This is actually the aspect that is going to eliminate the number one problem for first aiders, people panicking and not knowing what to do. If you're bitten by a snake, you can take your mobile device, scan the snake, and it will give you video instruction on what to do and which items to use as well. Uh, that doesn't actually, you know, float my boat because I think that in the areas that this may get a lot of use, that you, you, you'll have mobile coverage issues. We don't need a SIM card. You don't actually need mobile coverage when you're using it. Oh, all, wow. you, all you need to do is open the phone and scan the chip and it will take you where you need to go to the content that's pre-stored in there. You, you put that in for an innovation award. That's, that sounds really cool. Let's Pretty let's cool. dig into that. How does that work? I'm, I'm, Would you I'm like not a little to bit see? about. Is, is it there? Is yeah. it? Yeah. Oh yeah. We'll go and have a look. It's then. just a prototype, so it's not perfect. Okay. So within this prototype, what we've done is inserted a few chips where you see the symbol. So if you scanned over the minor injury, there you go, and it comes up with the video. The content is on an SD card. In the phone? Yes. And not only does it tell you what to do, but it directs you as to which items to use. You're the first person that I've seen tell Steve something about tech that he didn't know. <laughs> I understand how it works now. I understand how yeah, it works that, now. That's, that's all right. That's so. a first. <laughs> I'd be very interested in the US market. I think there's definitely a market for it there. And I haven't seen anything quite as clever as that. I've been in and around boats and horses and things. I think you're really onto something. I certainly believe in you and the product, but um, I'm a bit concerned about your the way you are in your manufacturing scalability. Sure. Ah, it's tricky. I'm tempted. I'm really stuck because for me to make this work, I'd have to take too much of your company at this point in its development. I think on the basis of that, at this point, I'm out. Thanks, Andrew. This was a fantastic pitch in terms of the way you, you presented it. I love backing people as opposed to products. But the outdoors and the camping sort of area is not my specialty. I'm out. Thanks, John. I appreciate that. Steve, where are you at? I do business because it's good business. Right. I like doing business with good people. Sure. But that, that doesn't, you know, it, it, it's still good I actually work at the end of the day. To me, it's worth about 250,000 bucks at this point in time, which is not an offer you'd like. I'd love to work with you, Steve. To me, it's worth about 250,000 bucks at this point in time, which is not an offer you'd like. I'd love to work with you, Steve. So, uh, I want to try and make you an offer. I reckon I could think better if I was sitting on a quad bike. Oh, go for it. Right. <laughs> uh, any In excuse. Oh, any no, excuse. Double With the horse. Yeah. I wanted a horse. Steve, could we pretend it's raining and I throw some water over you? Just to... <laughs> this, is, oh, this is cool. Here we go. Um, so the full amount, $220,000. 100000 of which will be equity for 40% of the business. The remaining 120 will be as uh, repayable on a royalty. Mm -hmm. 
at 10 bucks a unit. So he takes $10 of every product sold to pay down the 120 debt. Right. And the other 100 is for 40% of your company. Let's do it. Oh, there you go. That was easy. <laughs> Fantastic. Thanks very much. Awesome. Thanks, Mum. Well done. Well done. Mom, oh, you make some really sore. And okay, Steve, well I'll done. give you a $50,000 option for the US rights. Oh, okay, done. All right. Looking forward to getting the business. So much. Going to right. Right. Well, well, bye. Lovely to meet you all. See you. Bye. bye. <laughs> we are going to celebrate, and there might be a few cocktails too. <laughs>